Just take a look at yourself Do you really think it's gonna help? If you always fighting yourself Trying to forget how you felt Just take a look at yourself Can't even be your own friend Cause you're way too stuck in your head How do you think it's gonna end? Nothing that they could do Nothing that they could say Nothing that they could do To take all the pain away Sometimes it works out You win some and sometimes you won't But we could be everything, everything, anything that we see we could be We could be everything that we want We could be everything, everything, anything that we see we could be We could be anything that we want You think if they said it, then they must mean it So you should feel it, so might you think that you need it Others opinions To know how you're feeling To know if you're losing or winning Left behind or within it If you're sinking or swimming Existing or living Nothing up. that they could do Nothing that they could say Nothing that they could do To take all the pain away Sometimes it works out And sometimes it don't Sometimes you win some And sometimes you won't we could be everything, everything, anything that we see We could be, we could be everything that we want We could be everything, everything, anything that we see We could be, we could be anything that we want But we could be everything, everything, anything that we see We could be, we could be everything that we want We could be Just take a look at yourself Do you really think it's gonna help? If you always fight in yourself Trying to forget how you felt Just take a look at yourself Can't even be your own friend Cause you're way too stuck in your head How do you think it's gonna end? Nothing that they could do Nothing that they could say Nothing that they could do To take all the pain away Sometimes it works out Sometimes you win some and sometimes you won't But we could be everything, everything, anything that we see We could be, we could be everything that we want We could be everything, everything, anything All right, y'all, so I'm obviously finished styling this wig and this is what I got If you're interested in the details and specs and all those good things about this wig Then please continue to watch Okay, so the unit that I am rocking was sent to me by Genius Wigs. Shout out to you, Genius Wigs, for sending me this unit and sponsoring this video. I truly do appreciate it. So the wig that they sent me, I'm just going to read off the bag for now. Uh, it's, it says Genius Wigs Crystal Lace 13 by 6.5 Lace Front Wig. It's kinky straight, 22 inches, and 150% density. Okay, so I want to go ahead and talk about the curly baby hairs. That's some of the talking points for this unit. And as you guys saw at the beginning, and I'll just like insert a clip or something so you guys can see the, the unit came with very, very curly baby hairs. Um, 
they they were pretty dense so i did decide to sleek them down and i also want to show you guys when you do have those curly baby hairs like that it takes away from having to curl them you know like uh we uh went through this trend where we were using um the little uh flat iron to curl the baby hairs and then swoop it well when you have the hair that is already curled then it's easier to swoop so yeah i want to throw that out there as well also i know that the baby hair trend is not for everybody okay i get it so you can also straighten them and it'll give it a supernatural look or you can swoop it like i decided to do so i want to throw that out there so you guys know like that's what i did with my baby hairs but they do come curled and um also with this lace, this lace just kind of melts in. I don't know if you guys saw that, but the lace just melts in. The lace is lacing, okay? I didn't bleach this unit. I didn't tweeze this unit. How you guys see her is how old girl woke up. And on the side, here you can still see some of the curls from the hair, which does give it a more realistic appearance. And the knots, yeah. The knots are definitely really, really small. I Like I said, I didn't bleach them whatsoever. Okay, and they have on here, and I'm just going through the talking points that they asked me to talk on, because you guys know, I can't, my memory is like this, so I have to look at stuff. But uh, I also wanted to talk about that it's, this unit is glueless you guys know i the, the glueless thing never works for me i don't know why i don't know what i'm doing i don't know what it is about my head but glueless does not like me okay it just don't so i didn't do that but you can wear this unit glueless so i want to throw that out there as well you know despite the fact that i didn't do it it can be done it is a glueless wig okay i now i'm, I'm technically wearing it glueless but i did use adhesive so i want to throw that out there as well okay so on here it says genius wigs brown color kinky straight genius kinky edges pre-plucked 13 by 4 crystal lace front human hair wig for black women child thought we were past for the black women thing child uh, i'll give you a bit of a pass since it is kinky hair okay <laughs> all right so this one is available in 10 to 24 inches uh, all being even numbers and you can get it in 150 uh, uh, 200 or 250 now mind you they said mine is 150 and as you guys can see she's thicker than my baby cousin Ashley okay and that's 150 so I can only imagine what 200 and 250 looks like it's um it's available in the th 360 wig cap if you want a 360 or you can get the 13 by uh, 6.5, which is what I have. And they do have these units in um, small, large, and medium cap size. Uh, it just will take uh, an additional day, uh, seven days, if you get it in the small and large. So those are all the details with this unit. As far as shedding and tangling, girl, it's a kinky straight wig. I didn't expect it to do none of the things. Like at some point, it probably will, but straight out of the packaging, I did not expect it. No, girl, did not. It is big head friendly, but I would suggest you get whatever cap size you wear since they have it available. So, because I am an average cap size, okay? So I, I don't think too much about it, but if you have a small head or you have a larger head, then um, I would definitely just recommend you getting whatever size you wear. And yeah, that is pretty much it as far as the details and specs go. If you're interested in my pros and cons as well as a full 360, then please continue to watch. All right, y'all. So we're going to start with the cons because you know I like to end on a high note. My con with this unit is the the parting space y'all know that is just like a typical con for um a lot of the units that i get um that are 13 by 6 and now honey the part is parting up here even though i did uh, um a c part i could have definitely got away with doing a regular part with this unit because in that middle area there's a lot of parting space but on the sides there's not and like i said that is typically um a thing that i've noticed with the more high-end companies so yeah that is gonna be my con now my pros is first of all y'all know i love this color okay i love this color this is i say this in every video where i wear brown wig this is my natural hair color okay i messed it up a long time ago but this is the color my natural hair was okay so i love this color um it is it's super nostalgic for me i guess uh i also love that the unit came pre-tweezed i love the um the curly the baby y'all know i'm a sucker for the baby hair edges i think it is dope uh but um i love that i love that it's pre-tweezed and um pre-bleached because i'm lazy and i love the crystal lace so those are all my pros 
Yes, I would obviously recommend this wig. I feel like uh, because it's so easy to style and do all that stuff, it makes it extremely beginner friendly, as well as all the things that I listed as pros. So yes, I would definitely recommend this unit or basically any unit I have gotten from this company, I have loved. So definitely check them out. All right, I'm gonna give you guys this full 360 so we can wrap this thing all the way up. So this is obviously the unit in the front. This is on the left side. This is it in the back. Keep in mind, I am 5'4". And this is it on the right side. So yeah, y'all, let me know down below what you guys think. Let me know if you are feeling this unit as much as I am. I am interested in your thoughts and opinions. Sound off down below in the comments. And um, once again, shout out to Eugenius Wigs for sending me this unit and sponsoring this video. I truly, truly do appreciate it. And if you are interested in purchasing this unit, I will have a direct link to it down below in the description box for your convenience. And yeah, girl, <laughs> that's all. That's all. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions or you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, girl, click the subscribe button. It's not going to cost you not one red cent. And if you're not ready to follow me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and TikTok. I'm Healthy Missy on Snapchat and on Disastrous B on Twitter. And I'll see you, love bugs, next time. Bye. The looks you love completely got every style.